right now turning to the skies tonight. We got rained out today, but we are now drying out. WDSU Chief Meteorologist Margaret Orr joins us now with a look ahead to what we can expect this weekend, Margaret. Well, you know what's really cool? I decided to do the day on Twitter. So here is a look you can see. Sure enough, we've got a rainbow. That one happens to be from Kimberly. And then you can scroll and see all of the pictures people have sent me. But this one is from Jared Bro. And can you see it right there? That's the funnel cloud and the system that was rotating and moving right over the North Shore, right across the lakefront. So that was the storm warned for tornado warning. So that's a really cool shot. And then we can just scroll up and you can see all kinds of outflow boundaries. This is a shelf cloud. It happens to be from Liz. But wait, I wanted to show you this one. This one from Allison Bailey photo. Pretty cool. So share your photos with me on Twitter and I will try to show them. All right, here is a look at what's happening. We've got a cold front that's moving through and boy, did we have a whole lot of weather today. I'll take it through, take you through it real quickly. First of all, this is the tornado that was reported in EF1. That was over at Sherwood Forest and it was at 9.01 this morning. Same time at White Castle, also an EF1 tornado, 90 miles per hour. Then we had a lot of damage, probably the same storm. That was at Valero, New Sarpy, uh, Kelowna as well. And then that was a tornado very close to Marrero. Two carports were taken off. We can go on over here towards Socher. Numerous trees were down. And then a whole lot of reports of hail ping pong ball size hail right there at Baker and we had one inch hail right there at the north end of the causeway. So we can look at what's happening now and the rain is moving now. Though we did have a whole lot of rain. Some areas two to even five inches of rain. Gonzales was two and a third. Black Pearl two and a third. Gray two inches. The airport almost two inches. It was a mess. But look at what's happening now. All of that moves out. Tomorrow you will have off and on clouds. Maybe a sprinkle. I think it's going to be a good day. And then as you go into Sunday, it is going to be gorgeous. No rain is forecast. The high today, 81 degrees. The average is 80 at 69 now. Look at how the wind is shifting to the west. We will get that cold front through here, though it's really not here yet, upper 60s. But we are picking up a west wind, Baton Rouge and northwest wind. Low to the mid 60s for your morning low temperatures and then your high temperatures tomorrow near 80. So that is cooler than it has been. And there you can see during the day we're going to pick up that north flow. So I'm pumped about that with some drier air moving in. Look Looking at tomorrow, often on clouds, high temperatures near 80 degrees, looking beautiful for Mother's Day. Monday, mid 80s, and then as you go into the week, we're warming up, rain chances staying really low, so we're really done with the rough weather. Nice weather ahead.